After taking a good look into the county's most littered freeways recently, we've heard from you about even more trash along our roads. In this Your Stories follow up, News 8's Brian White went for a bike ride with a couple who showed him all the litter they see along their daily bike route. That's right, I'm on Kearney Villa Road where local cyclists tell me they're fed up with all the trash and litter on the side of the road. See how much trash there is? This is really disgusting, having all this trash here. Connie and Paul Gatch ride their tandem bicycle here regularly along Kearney Villa Road, and they've noticed a lot of trash piling up. It makes me angry. I like to go out for a bike ride to enjoy myself, and I just it's disgusting to see that. Last week, News 8 aired a Your Stories report about litter on our San Diego freeways, and Paul saw that segment. I got to thinking, I know a road where there's more trash than all the freeways combined. He and Connie showed us all the trash and litter alongside this stretch of Kearney Villa Road running from Miramar Road down to Highway 52. It's really bad now. It's almost like this is the second Miramar dump. They've both filed numerous get it done reports, but the litter hasn't been picked up and they're frustrated. It makes me feel sad because I love this city and to see this kind of disappoints me. During the pandemic, we've seen an uptick in roadside litter with more to go food containers and single use plastics. While we were filming, Connie says she saw litter thrown right out of a car window. I saw a water bottle come flying out of a truck. It's frustrating, you know, because you don't know who to talk to or who to take this to. A spokesperson for the city of San Diego cites a number of contributing factors, including the road's proximity to I-15 and the litter that blows off the freeway, vehicles traveling to the landfill, and the fact that this road is used by commercial and industrial vehicles that contribute more debris than your basic commuter vehicles. This road is cleaned by a street sweeper each Friday, but the city says it's unclear whether they have jurisdiction for areas off the road along this stretch next to MCAS Miramar because it actually runs through federal property. A spokesperson for MCAS Miramar tells News 8, quote, the city's easement extends to almost 200 feet in width for some segments of Kearney Villa and certainly throughout the immediate roadway, median and areas approaching the fence line. Trash removal, landscaping and other maintenance remains a responsibility of the city for their portions of the easement. Meanwhile, Connie and Paul still ride by here every day and they say all this litter ruins the beauty of the area. It kind of ruins the aesthetics, you know. I go bike riding to get away from the world's problems, and then I'm, as I'm bike riding, I see some more by the side of the road. In Miramar, Brian White for News 8.